we have here? Uh, let's start with the color. This is Garnet Red. Um, and the knobs, you'll notice they're beautiful. Uh, so what they are is they're a resin that resembles the buildup while you're uh, glassing a surfboard. There's usually dripping, you know, drippings off of the edge that build up that, uh, that these guys were, these builders were scraping and uh, molding them into knobs for cars, shifter gear knobs, etc. cetera, uh, for all the muscle cars and hot rod cars. And Andy Powers decided that that would be super, super cool uh, to use for the knobs, the switch tip, the trim tip, and the knobs. So these, uh, they come in three different styles. They come in cool, neutral, and warm. This is the warm style. Uh, very, very cool, very eye-catching. Uh, lead us right to the pick guard. This is the fire stripe pick guard. You can get a white faux pearl pick guard as well, um, which will lead us over to right here, what we have on the bridge. Three different types of saddles. Uh, there's an ebony, which is associated with a darker tone. Delrin, which is associated with a little bit more accenting the mid-range. And brass, which this is for your bright tone. Uh, so what do we have around the pickups? And I'll get into the pickups in a second, but it's an awful cool look. It's also on the back cavity panel as well. And they call that, that that's engine turned brushed aluminum something that you might find on a hot rod car, like maybe on a dashboard accent or something like that. Super, super cool. Um, there's two different kinds of pickups that are gonna be available in these. Uh, one is the FF42, which stands for full Faraday. Uh, it's a fully enclosed Faraday cage. They're this particular one. These are very, very warm. Um, and they are encased in the engine turned brushed aluminum. Um, what will be available a little bit later on, and we'll talk about that at some other time, I'm sure, are the PF42s, which are the partial Faraday uh, pickups. And we'll get into all of that stuff at a later date when we can really, really dive into uh, super specifics on this guitar. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, it's a full hollow instrument. One of the coolest things about this guitar is the neck profile, which is very, very comfortable, and it's also their compound radius. So the radius of these frets, uh, it changes, but it doesn't change this way, it changes this way. So when you're playing on your lower strings, there's a little bit more of a curve to it, and it flattens out as you get a little bit higher up uh, from like the D string down to the E string. We got this, and it's a camshaft trim. So what's going on here is as you manipulate it, each string is going to be able to get back to a zero point. There is a, it's very, very hard to see, but there's a zero point setting screw, and it's right back over here, and it's removable. And that will allow the bridge to either freely float or to be locked at a certain zero point to keep you in tune when you do. You come back and we're right back to being in tune. Uh, this looks like it's a symmetrical body, but it's actually asymmetrical. Um, so there's a little bit more kind of down over here than up over here. Not like a Mustang or a Jazzmaster Jaguar style, obviously, you can see that it's not. There's just a lot of things going on here that we would need a way longer video to do. And this is for the release, so this is just to kind of say, come on in and play this. So, very important fact here. It may be a little difficult, a challenge, to find one of these, as I only know of about eight dealers other than us that currently have these in stock ready for sale. They are very exclusive. I believe that there is a very low number of these being made per month, but we do have them. Uh, right now, 
the one that we're talking about and where we're showing right here. And there's also going to be two more for a total of three that we have in stock at the moment. If you have any questions and you're curious about availability, call the shop. You can ask for me, I'm Corey. Uh, that's a good idea before you make a trip down here because I have a feeling that these are going to go very quickly. Mm -hmm.